Best of all time, Jordan, Kobe, LeBron. Why wouldn't use those three? Some of those three or one of those three wouldn't even be in my top five. I, I, I hate that question. And I get asked it all the time. Who, who are you guys? Who's anybody to say, well, it's of those three? Will Chamberlain, they changed rules to negate how dominant he was. Kareem Abdul-Jabbar, a leading scorer and shot blocker in the history of the game for 40 years, is it? Now, I know LeBron passed him and things like that, but he passed him with three point lines and changes of rules. And there's so many guys that I, I would put in that handful of first five. Uh, I'm not certain that, that the guys that are suggested are always the ones that I would put in there with him. Oh, so check this out, right? So y'all see John Stock, the legendary point guard, one of a lot of people's top five point guards, all top 10 for sure point guard list of all time but y'all see he has some things to say so let's dig into it he said the goat is either Wilt Chamberlain or Kareem Abdul-Jabbar not a bad opinions at all not bad opinions at all both is up there points rebounds um just give you the numbers dominated in their era crazy numbers crazy stats crazy records but I think more controversial, he said, is one of those things where usually people are saying either Michael Jordan or LeBron James. Then you're having some saying Kobe Bryant. He said neither. But even worse, he said one of them is not in his top five. So we're going to break down and we're going to try to see who, but he didn't, because he didn't stay who. So we're going to see who is not in his top five. Let's start with LeBron James. LeBron has the points, as he said, because he spoke on Kareem being a leading scorer. But he said it took LeBron 40, it took 40 years for Kareem's record to be passed. And he said LeBron had to do it with a three-point line. Kareem didn't have that. So that could be a knock on him. He could be saying uh, LeBron's stats wasn't as impressive because he did it with the three-point line. So I guess that's his argument against LeBron. And you know this era, a lot of old school cats be having a, an issue with this era of players. So that's probably a reason why he could probably have not have LeBron in there. Kobe Bryant. We all know, like I said, the go debate is usually LeBron or Jordan. Kobe is in a lot of off a lot of people's top five. For some reason, he's I've even seen I've even seen some a lot of lists he's not top ten, which I think is is crazy. But as y'all see, it's a popular opinion, I suppose. So he could be amongst those, again, who thinks Kobe's not in the top five. And a lot of people look at it as we had Michael Jordan, who was the same. So we can't put somebody that was an imitator right there with him. So that would be the reason because they have Jordan in the top five to keep Kobe off. Have Jordan as a GOAT as a reason to put Kobe lower and outside of it. So that's the reason I got for the knock for Kobe. You know, I could go deeper in the stats or what people say about LeBron and Kobe, but you get it. Final one, Michael Jordan. I don't think I've ever seen a, a list with Michael Jordan off the top five. I think that would be just crazily insane or something totally different. But, you know, like he said, he hated when the list got to be minimized to them three. But who is the reason John Stockton was called over ring twice in back-to-back -back years? Michael Jordan. The bad boy Pistons got their rings. They was beating Jordan. But these guys, Bill Lambeer, Isaiah Thomas, they're getting bashed a lot for what? Saying Michael Jordan isn't the GOAT, discrediting his greatness or whatever you want to say. A lot of people say it's what? Because of bitterness. Tim Hardaway just called him out saying it was because of jealousy. Called out Bill Lambeer, that is. People call out Isaiah Thomas saying he's jealous of Jordan because Isaiah's from Chicago. Jordan played in Chicago. He get more love in Chicago than Isaiah did because Isaiah played with the rival. Y'all get the point. That could be a big reason why... He's keeping Michael Jordan off. Could be out of bitter jealousy or whatever you want to call it. So it's just a matter of who do you, until he comes out and speak, it's just a matter of who do you think out of those reasons listed or out of other reasons you, you believe why he might have. But he said out his own mouth, one of them is not in his top five. Who is it? Is it Kobe Bryant not in his top five? Is it LeBron James that's not in his top five? Or is it Michael Jordan that's not in his top five? Y'all let me know in the comments who you think John Stockton is hinting that out of those three goats is not in his top five. Like, share, subscribe if you're new and we out.